Hello ladies and gentlemen, Semineon here, and today we have found an underground structure. I have not found one of these before, so we are exploring this together. That's right, this is pretty deep and it's made of a lot of dense stone. Which is got a blast resistance of 60, so that's not too it's not too exciting. But still, okay, so right here we have like a little lobby area. Might be a personal computer. Got some steels ingots and stuff miscellaneous loot all right i don't know where you should go because there's like three doors here three sets of swords we'll go straight all right looks like we have a little side room here this looks like a uh it's like a testing room or something probably should not be flicking random levers hmm. Presto log, redstone, there's this uh, explosives. It's like, this might be a magazine or something. I'm just speculating. <laughs> this is crazy. I've never seen something like this in the HP regular tech mod. Okay, so we got more stuff here more machinery, more chests, enhanced circuits. <laughs> Do let me know in the comments what this is, though. Got glass for this is obviously a lab of some sort because it's got all this nonsense in here. I wish the computers actually worked. I would love to see if like there's any cool information on them, like secret like testing or whatever. I mean, why else would you have a lab underground? Great secret testing. All right, I think that's it for this this aisle way here. I think we look through all that. Yeah. Look at all this, like, tides and nonsense, power switches. I wish there had lights on it. Oh, they do have lights. It's just behind the vents. But are they functional lights, though? That's the real question. I doubt it. Alright, looks like we have a little washing room here. A little toilet. Mm. Well, bathroom, that's what it is. Alright, looks like we got more stuff here. This is like, looks like a little cafeteria. With more recording stuff. This must be like the crew quarters. The map. Okay, we got some casual sweater. An opinion. Well, I like it. I look cool in the casual sweater? Yeah, look at that. Kind of looks. It looks like, you know, <laughs> kind of fits the rest of my outfit, honestly. It's crazy. It's a little big, but regardless. Found a pistol in here. Hey. This must be the security like area. There's a little freaking microwave. So you can put your casserole in there. I like this. This is pretty cool. This is by far like the, uh, most decked out HBM structure I've seen so far. Actually, a naturally generated structure. You even got a little bobblehead here. Deuterium machines, telenium textures, reliant rocket. Run to the bedroom on the staircase to the left, you'll find my favorite axe. <laughs> That's funny. Look at that, we even got more doors. This is crazy. Oh, I think this is another bathroom. Yeah, this one doesn't have a, a secondary room to it, though. Interesting. Let's see what's in here. Okay, it looks like another office part of it. This is pretty cool. This is by far the biggest, like, underground HBM, like, structure I've ever seen. I wish the power actually worked in here, like if I could like flip a switch and have the lights come on, that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> I don't think that's happening. Be cooler if it did. Let's see. Let's see, there, yep, there's... Yeah, there's no way for like redstone connections to be anywhere, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I guess that would be hard to code in. But hey, look at that. That is still a pretty cool, like, structure regardless. By far, I would, if I had this in my survival series, I would live in it. 
all day, every day. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this short video. If you guys liked it, please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.